Hey there guys, it's Mr. Herbst here and today my focus is going to be on the types of joints in our body. Um, now a joint is a place where two bones meet. Uh, joints are connected by things called ligaments and there are three types of joints in our body. We have our fibrous joints, our cartilaginous joints, and our synovial joints. Now the first one I'm going to start with here is our fibrous joints. These types of joints are immovable. Um, that means you can't move them. Um, a really good example of that, and not, not a lot of people actually know this, but our skulls are actually made of many different kinds of bo bones that are actually fused together. So fibrous joints are sort of like joints that are fused together. They cannot move. A um, really good example of that would be like right here, right here between your frontal bone and your parietal bone, where they meet right there. Um, though You can't move those bones. They are fused together. They are what's called a fibrous joint. The next kind of joint is our cartilaginous joints. These joints are slightly movable. Um, good example of that is between the vertebra of your spine. So between the vertebra lies a chunk of cartilage um, that allows your body to, to have some motion, some, some sort of twisting motion, um, but not, not a whole full range of motion. A real, another really good example where you have cartilaginous joints is in your rib cage. Um, your rib cage it can expand and contract, but you really are limited in, to a lot of motions there. So cartilaginous uh, joints have slight are slightly movable. And then the last type of joint we're going to focus on is called our synovial joints. These joints here are freely movable. Um, the bones are separated by a cushioned cavity. Um, so a really good example of that would be um, in your elbow. A synovial joints are uh, something that you find in your elbow. They're, you have a high range of motion in your elbow. The two bones um, that hold together your arm are held together by ligaments. That's a really important word to understand. Um, ligaments connect bone to bone. Tendons connect bone to muscle, and that is a, uh, a focus in another video. But there are actually three types of synovial joints. You have your hinge joints, your pivot joints, and your ball and socket joints. The first one I'm going to talk about is the synovial hinge joints. The good example of these is um, your uh, elbow and your knee, where the, you can only move them really in one direction. Uh, you know, it's possible to hyperextend your arm possibly, but that really hurts and it can cause a lot of damage. Pretty much you are only limited in one way that those, those uh, joints can move. The next kind is the synovial pivotal joints. The, these allow for rotation. Um, a really good example of that is in your neck. Uh, between your cervix, um, your cervical vertebra right here in your neck allows you to go like this. That is a pretty large range of motion. Um, it's primarily rotational. Also, another, another pivotal joint you have in your body is what allows your forearm to twist like this on a pivot. Uh, rotational movement. And then the next uh, and last type of synovial joint that we have are the ball and socket joints. These allow for a very large range of motion. A really good example of that is what we find between the femur bone and your pelvis, which is your hip bone, and also your humerus, which is your upper arm bone, and your scapula, which is your shoulder blade or shoulder, shoulder bone. Um, here, right here is a picture of the femur and the pelvis right there is where the ball and socket actually occurs. And now if you know about ball, you, you, the movement of your leg, you can move it in a lot of directions. Also the ball and socket in your arm allows for a large range of motion. Um, that's because the ball sort of moves around in there while it's held in place by the socket. Anyway here guys, that concludes uh, types of joints. Make sure you complete the Google form below. This is Mr. Herbst. I'm signing off folks. You all have a nice day.